Cheaper pots. Cheap. Bug. I'm passing the phase of being tired to delusion. I have to go to Target before they close. Oh my gosh. It doesn't fit. I'm literally sitting on her lap. I miss my collide. Hi guys, it's Honey Bubble Bear. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm going to Coachella for the second time in my entire life. I say that so dramatically, but like, you know, I'm so excited. I can melt. Editing this is going to be crazy. Coachella. Okay, so I planned everything so last minute. Last year was my first time going to Coachella. I had the amazing opportunity of going with Direct TV, so that was insane. I had the time of my life. This year, something with YouTube Shorts was in the works, but then they decided to go in a different direction, which made me so sad. But I'm so grateful that I even get to go at all. We have a VIP tickets. They were not cheap. Let me tell you, I'm holding about three grand in my hand right now. We got an Airbnb. I cannot wait to show you. It is perfection. Overall, I'm just so excited to go and have fun. This is me putting it out into the universe that next year I will get to go with a super cool brand or maybe even YouTube shorts will take me. So we will see. Putting that out there. Hear me. Mind you, I would have gone to Coachella without a brand anyway, so this is, it works out great. I will say, Liquid IV did invite me to their event. I am so excited for that because I've heard Liquid IV throws the best events. I owe it all to you guys. I would not be able to afford these tickets if it weren't for you guys. I wouldn't be able to afford a freaking Airbnb. I was like, oh my God, like I cannot believe I'm doing this. Like I'm renting an Airbnb, like. Look at me. It's all thanks to you guys. I would not be able to do this if you guys didn't watch my videos, if you guys didn't support me in the way you do. And you did here. I love you guys and I'm taking you guys with me. So, yeah. <laughs> I fly out tomorrow morning. I still have so much to do. I at least have my outfits picked out, but everything else, I don't have picked out. Hopefully, I don't stay up till like three or four o'clock in the morning, which I always do. Anytime I fly anywhere or need to go somewhere, I always wait till last minute to pack. It is the day before, so I'm still doing that. But to this, oh, by the way, I got extensions. You can probably tell they're not blended in very well. My hair's pretty greasy, so. <laughs> Excuse that. I had something on my lip the entire time. So yeah, it's like excess lip gloss. I think I put too much lip gloss on. I'm a mess. So this is gonna be a two-part video. In this video that you're watching right now, I'm going to do a pack with me and me just flying and getting to Palm Springs. And the next video is gonna be all the get ready with me's and my experience at Coachella. Cause you never know what will happen at Coachella. First things first, Hazel is so cute. Secondly, I need to wash my makeup brushes. So let's go do that. After that, I need to take care of my skin because it is not okay over here. We are not doing okay. Okay, so these are all the brushes I'm taking. We don't let them dry. I have to go to Target before they close. So yeah, let's go do that. Okay, so I'm back. I picked up a bunch of travel stuff. I'm gonna go through this stuff later. It is 10.48 now. I'm gonna hurry and go wash my hair because it really needs it. I'm just gonna blow dry it and then straighten it. Then when I get to the Airbnb, I'll curl it. Just got out of the shower. I'm gonna brush my hair and then put in some product. I'm using this seven second detangler by Unite. I'm just gonna spray that all over. Now I'm gonna use this blow dry spray by Kevin Murphy and this smells super, super good. My hair's done. I, I knew it. Guess what time it is. It is 2.52 in the morning. I just wanna lay down. There is no energy in my voice anymore. I'm gonna go till 4 a.m. I laid out all of my makeup, hair stuff, body wash, like literally everything I need. It looks like a lot. The good news is, is everything is everything. Oh my gosh. The good news is everything is laid out and ready to be put in the suitcase. So that's all I have to do. And then I will be fully packed. I feel like giving myself another hour. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna stay down here and also gather the... <laughs> I'm struggling. My hair is so pretty. Fun thing about my extensions is I got the same length as my natural hair. Just really wanted to fill in my ends. My extensions sit right about here. And this is my natural hair right here. And you can see, look how full my ends look. I'm obsessed. So giggly right now. Hopefully my camera doesn't fall. I think it's because I'm passing the phase of being tired to delusional. <laughs> I'm just so tired. I'm thinking I'm gonna put most everything in these packing cubes that Typo sent me, so huge thank you to Typo. They also sent me a bunch of other things, which I will be showing you on my Instagram, so be sure to follow on there. Probably put like my hair stuff and maybe my makeup in here. I know I could put clothes in here, but I have this thing where like, if I'm gonna put clothes in these packing cubes, they all have to match. So I have black packing cubes that I'm gonna use for just my clothes, and then this will be for like accessories. Oh my gosh you guys i finally did it it is 4 49 in the morning i laid everything out that i'm going to be putting in my suitcase so it's easier for me to see if i'm missing anything my voice is 
completely okay gone also i didn't even show you these i saw these on amazon they're bad bunny slippers they're so cute they were like 15 bucks right here i laid out my four main outfits picked out one last one just in case i didn't want to wear one of the three right here i have a pile of extra clothes slash comfy clothes here i have pjs a swimsuit some you know tape underwear socks all that main purse i'm going to be wearing i'm only bringing one because i don't want to keep track of multiple purses I'm bringing my louis i hope i don't regret bringing it it's just so cute and it goes so well with all my outfits and then i have my jewelry in here this thing is from amazon by the way i will link it on my storefront but it holds all the jewelry so perfectly and it also has a hidden compartment for necklaces i love it so much i love the little mirror sunglasses i'm still deciding on which ones to bring i don't know about those two right here i have all of my shoes that i'm bringing all my makeup glitter body oil liquid iv of course all my tech stuff my wristbands so scared to leave these behind so i'm keeping them right here this is all of my hair stuff i'm bringing wish i had hair sparkle spray that would be pretty cool i'll probably put some of the fenty glitter in my hair i have my skincare which <laughs> i really wanted to bring more this is like my essentials like i have to bring these perfume couldn't decide on which ones to bring all my body oil body glitter lotion this goes with the tech stuff that is pretty much everything i'm bringing i'm gonna put everything in the suitcase now hopefully it fits when i shop with white fox they usually send their outfits in these zip bags there's there's no zipper here i'm so tired instead of throwing them away just wash them and then use them for travel i have four main outfits so i have four bags i'm going to put them in just so they can all stay together and organize I'm so tired. It's like 5 a.m. Yeah, it's 5 a.m. Now time to pack my makeup. Drunk Elephant sent me this really cute makeup bag filled with all of their products. So I emptied it out. Usually I use a bag that has a different compartment. Things may shift around a little bit, but you know, I don't care. Watch, I'm going to get to the Airbnb and be like... Oh, everything's just thrown around everywhere. Primer, more primer. Foundation and contour. These are so good. If you can't find the Drunk Elephant Dew Drop things, this is comparable. It is so good. It's by Say. Love this stuff. A little more than the Drunk Elephant one. Just say it. What can you do? Setting sprays and fixing sprays, whatever. Highlighter, blush. This blush is so cute. It's called She's That Girl. Patrick Ta comes out with the best stuff. This blush is so pretty. And the fact that it's called She's That Girl, how could I not own this? More blush, highlighter, rare beauty. Love rare beauty. My back is hurting from sitting like this. My body's just like, hey, Kelly, can you, uh, do you mind going to sleep? These are the makeup palettes I'm, whoa, palettes I'm bringing. This one is a new addition. It is worth me showing you look how beautiful and the middle look how pretty that is i'm putting that in the corners of my eyes so excited for that of course i'm bringing the patrick ta palette look how stunning this is bringing the makeup by mario palette as well when i'm at home and i'm bored i love playing with makeup like i'll do crazy looks that actually look pretty good I really just want to throw everything in here but my body will not let me like i have to organize it makeup by mario skin perfectors i love these so much your skin but better a rare beauty highlighter look how stunning this highlighter is perfect for your face or you can put it on your body i brought a body brush to apply it on my body because i want to glow brighter than the sun um <laughs> hazel's trying to get in here fenty beauty oh my gosh you guys like, doesn't matter where i'm going cannot go anywhere without this it is so beautiful look how pretty this is so gorgeous gives you like a wet look kind of but it also gives you like a glow i don't know how to describe charlotte tilbury that stuff. This is a must. We'll not go anywhere without this either. Eyeliner. This is how I have it so far. And everything's just thrown in there. These are all the lip products I'm bringing. I know it's excessive, but I love lip products and I'm always using them. I like to bring options. Makeup brushes in here. <laughs> I don't know if it's gonna work. I still have room for lashes. Wow, this is the best bag ever. Oh my gosh, this is a big mess. I'm gonna regret this, but whatever. So I am bringing quite a few products. Ah, look at that. I don't know if it's focused. Oh my gosh, my camera's gonna die. Mm. My lip products are in here. Oh, oh, wow. It worked. Hazel was about to eat these. No! <laughs> Makeup is packed. Oh, I have to pack. Okay, so is that here? That. Um, I didn't even see her sitting here. Oh my gosh. She's been all around with me, following me around all day long because you know, you know mommy's gonna leave. Oh, but I'll be back so soon. The hair in your eye. Look how she hugs me. And then I'll let go. Oh, mirror. 
She likes when I feel bad for her. Like, oh, what was me? Oh, what was me? Dang, I look great for it being six in the morning. Okay, so if I hurry up and finish this, if I hurry and finish within the next 30 minutes, I can sleep for two hours. Please enjoy this ASMR. I'm just gonna hurry up and do that. But I always felt that something's missing. I hope this doesn't weigh more than 50 pounds. Oh my god. Let's weigh this. I think I need to put it on a hard surface. Bad news, it is exactly 50 pounds. I'm gonna need a carry-on. It's 6.31 in the morning. I don't even care about the airport fit. I'm just gonna go to bed. Okay, let me figure this out. Oh, what? Me. I have to be at the airport at 11. Okay, there are two hours before. 10, 9. Leave here at 8, which means I have to wake up at 7.30. Gonna get an hour of sleep. I'm so late. I'm worried that they won't take my bag because I still have to check it in. Oh my gosh. Oh. I was like, why is the elevator not moving? I made it. The elevator wasn't opening because I didn't press the button. Rocky landing. I don't know what happened. Started listening to the pilot at the end of what he was saying. I probably should have paid attention. But something happened to where they had to land quicker than expected. Unnecessarily heavy. So we made it to the Airbnb. <laughs> it's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Sup, lady? <laughs> this is the living room and they decorated so cute in here. Look how cute. It's a little bean bag. The views are amazing. Windows literally everywhere. Giant TV. It's like a tilted, what are those things called? Like a vaulted ceiling. Vaulted ceiling. They even have pool towels. This cute little chair with a blanket. I'm all about the details. This is the outside. We can have breakfast out here but this is so cute it's like its own little like dining area but like outside and it's so nice outside too look at the view the fake grass wall thing here which is gonna be so cute for pictures excuse the oh my gosh so then you walk back in and there's another dining room table here so we can choose whether we want to eat outside or inside look how cute these mirrors are they're like the little squiggle mirrors that i have at my house this is the kitchen it's so cute so another place to eat we can have all the people here this is like the little pantry with the microwave some olive oil look at that the fridge which we already stocked with waters coffee strawberries fruit trash can is in the drawer which is pretty cool pots pans like they fully stock this place and it makes you feel like you're at home which is so nice everything is so updated too. Plates, cups, mugs, even coasters. So, so cute. This is stuff I would have at my house, but in the color white. Really modern and cute. It, this whole place is so aesthetic. The sink area with a beautiful view. Then outside, this is so cute. And I haven't even shown you the bedrooms yet. So this is what it looks like when you walk outside. Lights again going across the top. Look at the wall, another place to sit. Look how close that is. Insane. I'll just wait. <laughs> Okay. Excuse the appearance, but this place is so convenient. It is about 10 minutes from the airport and five minutes from Target and a whole shopping center. This is like, I'm literally coming back here next year. So y'all better book this before I do. When you turn the corner this way, another seating area, but it's so cute because it has a fireplace. It's so cute at nighttime. I just feel like I'm on vacation here and look at the wall. This is literally what caught my eye. The Palm Springs, the wall. This is the backyard lady looking so beautiful. Front door. So then you turn this way. Walk in. Washer and dryer. If you forget anything, they'll most likely have it. Anyone else have these doors and like, have you ever like pinched your finger in between here? It hurts so bad. First bathroom. Vanity turns on. Like this is so cute and it looks like a little stone. And then you turn, this is the shower. Isn't it so cute? Uh, body wash, conditioner, shampoo. We have the rainfall shower. I don't know what this is, but I mean, it adds to everything. And on the right, there's another room. Nice TV, still the same vibe. This is where ladies staying. Closet is massive. This is actually my first time seeing this closet. Walk out and then go to the right. This is a whole room itself. So you have like the separate door. The bedroom's that way. To the left, you have your own bathroom. The exact same thing. A towel rack for all your towels that you've already used. Same thing with the bathroom here. This makes me feel like I'm in a hotel or something. This is where I'm staying. Room is massive. So to the left, you have the sliding glass door where you can go outside again, where we just were with like the kitchen right there. I already have my stuff everywhere. You can literally see the backyard from your room. This is so much better than a hotel. Best part about this room is the giant mirror. This whole thing is a closet. That's pretty much it. That's the place. Oh, this is how packed it is. I'm trying to make it work so I can sit down. Okay. Well, just, just plop your booty. It doesn't fit. I'm literally sitting on her lap. Sit, 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 sit. That way. <laughs> and Around, I can't move behind her. her. Here, I'll hold your phone. Stick your legs that way. Oh, okay. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, 
I want to show you my outfit for we week. I was gonna say weekend too, but it's day two. <laughs> That's so cute. I never felt more beautiful in my entire life. Okay, bye. Hi guys, so I've been really bad at vlogging, but it's the end of day two. We just got home. The shoes were not really that smart, but you know what? It's fine. My feet hurt so bad. These shoes, giant mistake. Ended up loving my hair. I think I might do the same hair tomorrow. We're gonna go to bed, rest our feet, and we will see you tomorrow. I thought this was gonna be like a two-part video, but I think we're just gonna do a one-part. Yeah. Not happening. I'm hoping tomorrow I actually film more. We're going to Coachella during the day, so it'll be super fun to kind of see Coachella at a different scene because we've been going at nighttime. I'm gonna talk about why I'm here because it's not because of a new album. It's because, not that there's not a new album, it's like, I'm just got done watching Frank Ocean. It was kind of weird. It was an hour late and then there was a lot of pauses in between songs and there was a lot of songs he was playing that like I didn't really know so yeah. Oh my gosh look. Had that on my nails. Girls don't cry. Do you guys remember that? We're about to Uber home. It's gonna take us a little bit to walk there. Then we're gonna get food and then Lady and I have to pack with Bo. Uh -huh. And we have to leave the house by 9 a.m. tomorrow because we're gonna drive to the airport. So it's gonna suck. But if we pack tonight, we'll be able to wake up and just go. Good morning, guys. It's our last day here. I am sad. Good morning. Hi. How do you feel? Fine. I'm resting my feet. I'm trying to be nice and make you breakfast, okay? Thank you. Look it. Dude, I told her this looks like fun. <laughs> Thanks, lady. Hey. Oh, hello! Hi. <laughs> okay, I look really rough right now, but I missed my flight. So I had to buy a flight to go to Vegas one way and then a flight back to home. So yeah, and I got a partial refund, so that was good, but this day has not been the best. Let's see what else goes wrong today. No, I shouldn't be like that. Manifesting a good rest of the day. This day could not get any worse. It just got worse. I'm not doing escalators right now. Apparently, I'm in Terminal B. I'm at the LAX airport. It's a journey to get there. So she printed out my boarding pass and she wrote directions down for me because that's how far it is. I have to take a shuttle to Terminal B. She wished me luck. She gave me instructions to get there the quickest because my flight literally leaves in an hour. I also have to pee so bad and I'm hungry. Okay, update. I just got through TSA and apparently I'm at the wrong section of the airport. My walk is 40 minutes. My flight leaves in about 45 minutes. I'm still walking. I just got a notification saying my flight is boarding and I'm about half an hour away. I think I have to go upstairs. I have no time to take the elevator. I'm just gonna carry everything upstairs. Oh my god. I'm on the verge of crying right now. The tears are coming back downstairs. I'm about to give up. I'm outside. <laughs> Okay, so I made the flight. As you can see, I'm sweating so bad. I had to use my inhaler because I was running so fast. Kelly? Okay, 30 minutes to Vegas. Then I'm gonna meet up with my sister. She's literally on her flight right now and then she's gonna wait for me at the airport and rest until seven when my flight leaves back home. I'm finally back home. I have a voice. I feel so much better. It's actually two days later. I'm sure you can hear it in my voice and in my energy. I am just so happy to be home. Although it was super fun at Coachella, I am so wiped out. Just took a shower and now I'm ending the vlog. My house is a complete mess, so I'm gonna have to do a spring cleaning video. So be sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications because that video is coming real, real soon. Also, if you wanna know what I ended up wearing to Coachella, be sure to follow me on Instagram. I have all my fits on there. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Dang, that's a wrap. Cut. And ah, like I feel so good. I actually slept. Look who's here. It's Kazel. You wanna say bye? She doesn't wanna say bye. Come here, say bye. Pa. Bye guys. <laughs> I try to catch.